all right hello everybody i hope everybody's doing well today um got a new video that's been recommended several times it is in indonesia makes us feel alive and it is by the firmware chronicles so please go ahead i need to go ahead and subscribe to them give it a like and hopefully this is going to show me some parts of the country that i haven't got to see in some of the other videos um i'm really looking forward to it I have not heard nothing but great things about this video. Um, please like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Please show them some love. Also. And here we go. Asia makes it alive. Where do I begin? Indonesia felt like a place we had been to many times before, just not in a waking state. As fantastical as this might sound, what we found here was quite literally the stuff dreams are made of. Okay, I'm gonna say, have to say, these people have some quality gear. Wow. Indonesia is so vast that it's difficult to bundle it under the umbrella of just one country. With its some 18,000 islands, there are entire worlds waiting to be discovered. Our limited exploration of Bali, Java, and Sumatra during our previous adventure serves as a striking reminder that we merely scratched the surface. It would take multiple lifetimes to fully explore the wealth of wonders this country has to offer. Oh, so they've been here before. Five forty five AM. I'm sorry, I do not get up at five forty five AM. I might be awake at five forty five AM, but that's because I haven't sleep yet. Can I, can I carry you? Let's go. There's something truly magical about witnessing the sunrise from a boat. But that's not all we're here for. Can I tell you my secret dolphin call? <laughs> I feel like it's moments like these that remind us to do more with our time here. There are only few things in life that never get old, and one of those is dolphins. Are you ready to get in? The dolphins are right over there. Are they going to swim with the dolphins? Let's go for it! It reminds me of Waterworld. Kevin Costner fishing himself. Got undone. Uh, oh, dolphins, dolphins, right in front of us. Hurry up. What's okay, a boardy? Okay, left. Ready? Ready? Go. go. Dolphins, ready. And suddenly, we were in their world. Oh, that would be fun. You see dolphins? That would be so fun. Do you want to go on a waterfall hike with Papa? Yes! Liv is sleeping. That's why it's just me and you. Okay, see you guys soon. Bye! Brody, it's getting louder. Oh, look how pretty that is. Wow. Look at that. A 
I think we have a slight obsession with vehicles that can go places others cannot. It's like a safari car. Oh, he's modding it, isn't he? Huh? Booty, we can go up in there. Which comes in real handy when exploring the new and old lava fields of an active volcano. I heard that a volcano erupted today. Hopefully nobody's in the past. Um, 12 hikers were dead and 12 more were missing or something like that. Hopefully everybody watching this safe and out of harm's way. I think it was on Sumatra. Do you see that rock you're standing on? Yeah. Yasa is going to show us something with that. What do you think is underneath us? Lava. I it's think there's a big <laughs> lava cave. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I made a map this way to get to the volcano. So oh, pretty. <clears throat> Unbelievable. It's just endless fields. Before the lava here, before the eruption, Battle Village was here in this area. The special thing. Oh, there wow, a village used to be there. The lava is not coming in in that area, only that area. And the place which is now the big tree over there, it was a temple. Oh, that used to be the temple. Possible, there is a wall of lava, almost as tall as these trees. Yeah, if you have something sensitive, you will feel the energy here. It's hard to fathom how a 30-foot wall of lava would stop and navigate around. It's not just that it stopped there, but it goes on for another mile. Unbelievable. I've got the best portable pillows. <laughs> 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 Got the bed portable pillows. <laughs> Bodhi just found the coolest part of the rice terraces. Look! <laughs> wow! Are you nervous? No. Based on the number of buckles around you, maybe you should be nervous. <laughs> oh, that'd be fun. Look at that. Why do you have a slingshot? Monkey, the uh, one aggressive, just the <laughs> not the almost uh, stone. No, no, what just the wire. Monkey got <laughs> after. Yes. <laughs> so do we need that? Should we bring that with us? Yeah. Liv, do not touch the monkey. Okay. I touch every single one. I'm a monkey. You are a monkey, <laughs> and they'll know. Boot due to the urban forest habitat. I think he mean that. So they don't go out raiding the local villagers. I saw a guy just taught the kids how to call the monkeys and they all started calling and then hundreds of monkeys started appearing out of the woods right at us wow. and here we are. This isn't terrifying at all. <laughs> They're everywhere. He doesn't want to get down. <laughs> He's like, I'm good here. He's, He's comfy. He's tall. It's like a tree. <laughs> When I see those monkeys, it's like gazing into the reflection of our untamed kin. And you know what? Judging by how carefree <laughs> their lives appear, maybe we made a mistake ditching the trees. <laughs> I'd still live in a tree yeah, if I it. could. The last one. That's it. <laughs> the next morning, I snuck out by myself hoping to witness the Hindu sunrise ritual practiced by many across Bali. Little did I know oh, that I would end up being welcomed and invited to share breakfast with one of the local families. Oh, how cool. These are moments that don't always make it on camera, but let this be said, the people of Indonesia are hands down some of the kindest and most welcoming souls. I actually have to agree with that from a lot of the comments that I have read from people of Indonesia and my video.
they're some of the nicest people that I've encountered on the internet. I just hands down. We have encountered anywhere. I just left their home and I'm still in, in shock and awe that this would happen, that someone would invite me like this into their home. I mean, it's such a- Let's see what he's gonna get. A, uh, Non-Western thing to feel like people just like connection and sharing each other's culture in a way, right? But yeah, I'm absolutely inspired and over the moon. It's incredible. But he's gonna get from right next stop. Uh, we didn't get to see it. Potatoes. Java. Yeah, I wanted to see what they were gonna give him from. I don't know what an Indonesian breakfast would be like. I would be so happy if that happened to me. I would be so happy. Two thirty a.m. Time to hit Mount Bromo. Buddy. Yeah. Do you know what we're doing <clears throat> this morning? Why are they bundled up so much? Yeah. They cold? We're doing this. Yeah, it's so many jeeps. So many jeeps. Here they come. Wow. This is so crazy. This is insane. Ooh. What are we going to do if the volcano erupts while we're up here? You run it back down, get in your car, zoom away, call a police to stop it and put a gate there. That's a sudden emergency plan. Did you get that, Bernie? Yeah. No. Time to descend into the sea of sands. It's usually a bad sign when everyone else is going that way. They're going this way. Are you going to be driving? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Pretend like you're you're holding on for dear life left. <laughs> this is such a great family. I just love seeing the family dynamics here. Such a good family. Ready for this? this is the easy part, right, Bodie? Let's count to six. One. What was I saying about this being the easy part? I think we're at like 1,062. <laughs> we lost count. Hey, Liv, do you hear that gurgling? That's the volcano. Holy crap. Wow. How was that? Somebody had to carry that it's drone amazing. up there. <laughs> Standing on the edge of an active volcano to hear and feel the Earth's immense power is nothing short of breathtaking. Oh. She's lying all the way down there? Yeah. Okay. Nice. She doesn't want to use her feet, so that's the way she goes. Hey, work smarter, not harder. Exactly. <laughs> well, that was easy. <sighs> <laughs> the recent volcanic eruption threw a wrench into our travel plans. Uh, uh. Yeah, oh, no. It's supposed to be a three hour drive, it's now a five hour drive, and we just got to. Which means it'll be more like a seven hour drive. Well, we can just maybe just go through. Can we just go? Cannot buy. Mm. Hello. <laughs> go by. Oh no. Hello. <laughs> and after making a couple of friends along the way, we eventually got there. Ah. Look at that. where the waterfalls originated. That is so it's like, beautiful. It's like it's animated. It must be just like underground rivers or something like that. It's literally just spilling out wow. the side of the soil there. 
Do you want to get down there to the waterfall? Yeah! One of my favorite things about our travels is that we get to expose Liv and Bodhi to genuine adventures, allowing them to face challenges and experience the satisfaction that comes with real accomplishments. Yeah, it looks like everything is just held up by bamboo and some ropes. Um, I think I should put the camera away because I need all hands. <laughs> all hands, all on, hands deck. on deck. All this right. is crazy. It's so slippery. Oh, oh my gosh, we found a monkey. <laughs> After repelling down a waterfall, we assumed the worst was over, but turns out we were just getting started. Now that we all zip it up, I think the first challenge is going to be crossing this river. Mike, remember you did that when we were with the Ventilize. We cross rivers all day, every day. So we've got this, right? Right? How pretty that is. Adventure parenting. Wow. Sadly, it was time for us to wake up from this dreamlike adventure. Though I have a feeling that this is not the end, but merely the beginning. All right, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. Indonesia makes us feel alive. That is so well produced. I mean, their their equipment is superb. Cameras, just the quality of their shot, home footage, everything. And it seems like such a genuine family. The only thing I regret, I wanted to see what he got for breakfast and he was invited into the person's home for breakfast I, that would be so amazing that that is that is I, i'm beyond words i just can't imagine what that would be like anyways let me know what you think in the comments um please like subscribe if you haven't already if you don't stay safe wherever you are do something nice today